welcome to Gladiators Survival in Rome. This episode with better uh, sound because I just bought a new pair of uh, headset with microphone. First, let's collect the cooked meat and make some more, and let's continue with our adventure. Craft the concrete. I need some more uh, crushed stone. Let's see if I have enough. Besides, yes, yes, and some clay and water. I am uh, still uh, restoring that uh, other villa. Okay, pick is broken, so when the when a, a tool is broken, we need to repair it. it we are going to spend more uh, energy or stamina and uh, as you know if you are playing the game radiators has this uh, only big disadvantage the fact that uh, we can't easily get energy okay find the concrete let's see yeah I can craft it also need some carved clay brick let's see clay brick yeah and fire brick and straw for straw I need uh, help grass I mean yeah. I like that uh, radiators gives uh, a small task and uh, it also shows you where to get the, the stuff you need and every time you, you complete a, a task you, you get this uh, sense of achievement so this is one of the, the, the aspects of the game which makes it a great game now because I have uh, to wait for the grass to grow I'm going to, to hunt for the rabbits Cooked meat is the easiest way to, to get uh, energy. Okay, take all. Also, let's let's uh, get some uh, locks and maybe some stone because we we we, we keep. Uh, using uh, stones and uh, blocks another rabbit here thank you for the meat and the height alright let's see some more stones also I have the impression that I get uh, I already have plenty of uh, stones Last update uh, uh, gave us a new storage where we can uh, put almost everything, I guess. And yeah, small improvements which make the, the game better. I'm kind of uh, in. Uh, how to say? I haven't progressed uh, much later, also I, I kept uh, I kept uh, playing, but <coughs> I'm doing this uh, side quest a few bricks here because I need that sign. I, I don't remember its name. So if 
once I finish the, I complete finish the side quest, I will get 50 shards, 200 gold, and that uh, one item. And I think I need that for uh, some other stuff. Yeah. Okay, so let's let's also check the the area where the enemies are spawning because enemies give some loot and uh, sometimes coins. Yeah, East Forest, yes, enemies. I also uh, I consider that it's not uh, worth to repair the clothes, the armor, when you are just doing such uh, side quests, or you are simply roaming the, the places uh, looking for enemies. This is uh, the villa where I have the side quest. Perusia. And I still have uh, some missions here to complete. But I will uh, I will slowly get there. Right now I'm building this uh, location which is very nice. Aquilina Domus. I like the, the Roman architecture. And indeed they, they used concrete, maybe for the, the first time in uh, known history. It's not that uh, hard to make it. We all know the, the Romans were uh, excellent engineers <coughs> for their time. Sometimes I'm uh, curious if they got their knowledge from the ancestors or uh, all, the, all their improvements were uh, their own uh, discoveries. Collecting the the mushrooms, we can uh, use the mushrooms to to brew some uh, better uh, uh, meal. Okay, a club, why not? And some more coins. somebody else villa, I believe. It would have been uh, nicer if we were, were able to, to change the villa name, Villa Tarkini. And no, the grass is not yet ready, so let's just craft more uh, cooked meat. And we use the, the new storage. away some stuff. Well, I can upgrade it further. Let's see. And I, but I need more uh, shards. 200, I don't have yet. I have only 85. So yeah, this can wait. The grass will be ready in two minutes. So I guess it's time to, to play this little game and get more energy. Right. 
I'm not paying uh, that much attention to the moves, but uh, it's, a, it's a cool game, it's fun to play it, and uh, it uh, gives extra energy, so yeah, this is very nice. concerning this game that if you you keep doing the, the same moves you end up by getting the most out of it probably Deutsch is all good. because you, you, you can uh, play it without being in a hurry you just make those small tags you can uh, focus on upgrading your villa for example I, I still uh, have to build the ship pasture, the barn and the dairy farm but first I want to, to finish that uh, side quest I have this uh, goal of mine to first complete the side quest and the straw will be ready in 9 minutes yeah. excellent and I also want to, to check something As, oh, level 1, let's, let's also yeah, let's uh, Excellent. I'm sure 
some point I will have to to use all those uh, items giving uh, restoring energy. Gifts of the gold, I, I never used this, it's not that uh, expensive. So if you have some extra money, I think you can uh, you can uh, fast your progress. Yes, this uh, this is the new the new cave which came with the last update, and I'm curious if it. Uh, Reset, but I guess it doesn't reset, and I'm pretty sure I already visited all of it. But you know, it's never uh, a bad idea to, to double check. An altar, what is this? I can't interact with this, maybe at some point in the storyline. I love the, the color in this cave, the, the blue mist is extremely nice, it's gone uh, faulting, I guess, yeah, comforting for the eye and comforting for the heart, it's a labyrinthic cave. Basically, it's a huge cave. It has one uh, ent entrance and one exit. So, let's see, it has two access points. But the, the exit is on, on the, the exit to global uh, The exit is to the global map is the the same regardless the the point you choose to exit. So it would have made uh, more sense to have different exit points. Maybe the, yes, this is the second one. Maybe uh, they will expand it sometime in the future. Anyway, I, I love uh, the addition, mostly because this uh, this second cave gave us a lot of uh, uh, coins, gold coins, and if you don't want to constantly use the trader to get the gold. Yeah, the cave was a nice addition. Anyway, let's check. Let's check the straw. Five minutes. I still have to clear some debris now and there. Anyway, uh, this being said, thank you for watching. I hope you are also enjoying this uh, wonderful game. It's constantly developed by the team. I heard by watching the teaser and uh, the official Discord server. The, the next update will also bring some nice features if you want to, to learn more about them please check the director's official uh, social uh, pages until next episode thank you for watching have a good day and goodbye